slavery has been a universal institution for thousands of years, as far back as you can trace human history. And what we're looking at is if slavery is something that happened to one race of people in one country, when in fact the, 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 the spread of it was around the world. In, in 1776, which is when Adam Smith published The Wealth of Nation, as mm -hmm. well as when the United States got started, he said that Western Europe is the only place in the world where there is no slavery. Uh, and even in the Western, even the Western Europeans had vast numbers of slaves in the Western in, Hemisphere, yes. but not in Western Europe itself. And so if you're going to have reparations for slavery, it's going to be the greatest transfer of wealth back and forth uh, and between and and and, and cross hauling, as they say in, in the railroads, because the, the number of, of whites, for example, who were enslaved in uh, North Africa by the Barbary pirates exceeded the number of Africans enslaved in the United States and in the American colonies before that put together. I know, but nobody is going to North Africa to ask for reparations because nobody is going to be fool enough to give it to them. Uh, here we have we have intellectuals. Who can, who can imagine a different history from the rest of the world, even though it's so similar to the rest of the world. 